For the past few updates now, people have been asking for the Spike Puma to come to War Thunder, and it finally has. And now the big question, is it good? It's good, yes, but it's probably not worth it, and I'll tell you why. The baseline Puma in the German tech tree is placed at 10.0. Meanwhile, the Spike Puma is placed at 10.7 with only Spike missiles and an upgraded engine. And if you want to get even more technical, it gives you a larger ammo rack, and it makes it possible to be overpressured by your own spikes. Performance-wise, the 10.7 and the 10.0 Pumas are not very different, and in my opinion, it's not worth up-tearing yourself by 0.7. BRs to basically just have spikes. Not to mention the German tech tree only has one 10.7 in the entire game, that being the new Puma. All the rest are either at 10.3 or 11.7. If you guys were paying attention, I nuked while playing this Puma trying to get clips and noticed that I did not once use the spikes. Overall though, the Pumas are a pretty well-rounded eye of V. So even though I've been trashing on the 10.7 Puma this entire video, you can still do very well on this thing. For it being an eye of V, the Puma has an extremely good survivability just because of the amount of ERA slapped on the side of these things. In addition, it is very versatile because you get dart rounds and ahead rounds along with now spikes, meaning that you can basically fight any enemy in the game and you can still come out on top. And don't even get me started on the electronics of this thing because you have Gen 3 thermos, I believe, IRST, and IRCM. So overall, it's a very good IFV, I just wouldn't shove it into your 10.3 ground loadouts. 